Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. Bookmarks are something you've most likely seen and used in web pages before. Anytime you click a link that takes you to another place in the same page, that's a bookmark. A bookmark is a type of link that's used to take visitors to a certain point within a page without having to reload or download any information. Common applications for bookmarks are in very long pages such as frequently asked questions pages or long reports that may have a table of contents at the top. You also often see a link that says something like back to top. This is simply another link that leads to a bookmark back at the top of the page. One of the nice features of bookmarks is that they're not visible to your visitors. They simply appear as hyperlinks. To insert a bookmark, first click the point at which you'd like the link to lead to, or select some text that you'd like the link to lead to. Then click Insert in the menu bar and click Bookmark. In the Bookmark dialog box, enter a short, simple name for the bookmark. You want to keep it short and simple so it's easy to recognize and easy to use. Once you've done that, click OK. You can recognize text that has a bookmark applied to it because it will be underlined with a dashed line instead of a solid line. However, this dashed line does not show up in the live online version of your web page. OK, so we've completed one step of the bookmark process. We've entered the point at which a hyperlink will lead to. Now we need to create the hyperlink that leads to this bookmark. So I'll scroll back up to the top of my page to my table of contents and then select the text that will have the hyperlink applied to it. Then to add a hyperlink, if you remember, click insert in the menu bar and click hyperlink. Once again, Front Page 2000 has a slightly different process and look to it. You still select the text and then click Insert and Hyperlink, but here click the Bookmark drop-down and select the bookmark you'd like the link to lead to. If you remember, I called that one When. Once you do that, simply click OK. In Front Page 2002, and 2003, you can either click the bookmark button or in the link to section you can select place in this document. You'll see the same list of bookmarks as if you click the bookmark button. Once you've selected a bookmark, click OK. Now let's go ahead and preview the page to see if our bookmark works. If the bookmark works, when I click When Is, I should be taken to the bottom of the page. Now to go back to the top, I'll click the Back to Top link that leads to a bookmark at the top. Don't forget that when creating a page with bookmarks, if you want a link to lead back to the top of the page, you'll need to insert a bookmark at the top of the page. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.